One more creature passive. One more creature to the slaughter. Go on. Go on to the slaughter. God, you're making me look so uncool. There he goes, to the slaughter. Now feast, feast on him. Yo, what's going on guys? Riot's here and my base is officially starting to get laggy. I guess like one giant colossal titan extra was the was the limit. Like I found the freaking, it's weird that this is even laggy. You know what it is, it's this teen titan's base is, is, is most likely the main trouble starter here. But like uh, simply after having a teen titan's base, there's never any going back. Like are you out of your mind? Okay, we have a couple days till Genesis 2 drops, which is gonna be insane. Me and Crisco have our series all ready to go. Like we're just gonna be beating the entire survival series together because nothing sounds better than getting Crisco killed in hilarious funny ways across Genesis 2 so make sure you have notifications disabled down below right next to subscribe so you guys get notified when our adventure goes live because if I get another copyright strike from one of my foolish antics you guys will have no idea because YouTube will not notify you that I'm playing also get ready on the 31st which is tomorrow oh my god is when Mothra goes live on the workshop for everyone to download her and witness her magnificent beauty all on your own remember the most important button that you need to know when taming a mothra is left control it's really all you need to know no other button even matters <laughs> no other button in this entire game matters bro i know we've done this in like five videos now you guys are probably getting sick of it but it is just oh she's i didn't even notice she stands up that can't be new that's had to have been is that new was I always just looking at her butt at this part of the dance? I think that might have been what actually is happening because her butt shakes like crazy when she's doing the dance. Leave a like on the video and subscribe if you guys want to be awesome and help me out. I had a bunch of goals today. Okay, here, 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 was, here was one of my specific goals because I re-added the SCP mod, which has been having a bunch of updates since we got rid of it just to clear out spawns. And some weird stuff has been spawning near my base. Like this, okay, look, craft human flesh from Ingrams from blood packs and raw meat, then send tamed SCP-939 after it. When it kills them, use the opportunity to run up and feed it quickly and run away. It recommends staying semi-close. That sounds like the most like, pain in the ass SCP tamings. Oh my god. I'm sure there's some reason for it. Like the mod developer Ghidorah always has crazy SCP backgrounds for creatures. He knows about like every SCP and all their mystical stuff, so I'm assuming this one just kind of is a part of 939's like background. What's this? Lore! That's the word lore. That's the word I'm looking for. Crap, do we gotta go tame a 939? Alright, so that sounds like the first thing, the first task to do. I want that Wendigo so goddamn bad. I don't even want to go aggro it because it might just kill me and then it'll set me back 20 minutes like they always do. But like, or Wendigo. I get yelled at so much for saying it wrong. Everyone always says it's Wendigo. But here's the thing. I learned how to pronounce my monster names from Supernatural. Sam and Dean are professionals, okay? Unless some of you guys are professional like grade A hunters who know hunting monsters a little better than Sam and Dean. I don't think you're in any position to be correcting them. For God's sakes, they did so much. Like they've met, <laughs> they kicked God in the nuts essentially. I forgot we have a scanner on the server. Thank God, dude. Makes it a bajillion times easier. Okay, so SCP-939s, there's just none on the map. Or no, wait, I have to click it and then I click search. Yeah, I'm stupid. Okay, I figured there's actually a bunch all over. Sweet. A juvenile 939. That'll be way funnier to have like the monster kill it. I'm, I called it the monster because I hesitated from saying Wendigo. Like, I may have stood tough with my Sam and Dean argument, but I guess at the base of it, I'm still a coward. <laughs> Look at those children over there. E instantly aggroing on us too, little, little monsters. I feel no shame about this. Stay passive, Martha. Now, I did just wake up from like a super long Call of Duty binge, so my, my, my brain isn't quite what it usually is, which already isn't that great. Okay, these guys tame super duper easy, thank God. I thought it was gonna be some whole giant pain in the ass. This That was, that was the easiest thing on the planet. Easiest stuff on the planet is my favorite. You're all a bunch of savages. How dare you ever attack Mothra? Queen of monsters? Stuff from Monster Hunter attacking the queen of monsters? This is like a direct conflict of interest right here. Absolutely. Also, last episode, I talked over the possibility of... Um, I didn't bring any mutton or any taming stuff for this. I'm so stupid today. I talked over the possibility of changing Mothra's taming stuff to make her easier to tame, but after speaking to multiple mod developers, we have discovered that to be impossible. Or it is possible, but it would kind of break the mod. Apparently she sped up pretty fast already, but with fat delays, I can't remember the, the explanation. It was so scientific and beautiful that it swayed me instantly. 
I, I, I believed in it, but I did not memorize it. Oh crap, I accidentally healed him some amazing stuff. Whoa, dude. How could you still attack me while that's going on? Like, what kind of horrible person are you? This aloe is seriously like, such a, such a piece of shit. <laughs> oh, I'm out of bananas. My protein shake today didn't include bananas. And oh man, essentially the banana keeps it from being like chemical poop juice because that is what I'm burping up right now. That is some toxic crap right there. <laughs> uh, bananas make my day, I had no idea. All right, little buddy, where you at? Who did it? Oh, damn it! It's just about how quick you can click the button! I can click it so fast, bro! Woo! That was intense! Oh, shit! Oh, God. Oh, crap. Okay, well... I feel like I'm making some mistakes right now. I'm bleeding like crazy. I kind of spasm. I shot one thing and then everything started else getting shot and it all just went really downhill America right there. But <laughs> I have faith. All right, little buddy. No point in naming this little bastard. He's being raised for the slaughter. I hope it just takes one of them. Although, to be honest, if we do have the ability to feed children to the, to the Wendigo before taming it, I think- uh, Oh, that's why! You dirty bitch. Okay, so we need some human flesh, which requires bud blood packs and raw meat, which is totally acquirable with our little handy dandy buddy on the floor right here. Actually, I wonder how much health he has left, because I feel like I've drained him for- Oh, he's healed perfectly. All right, sweet. Thank you so much, Trisco, for making donations to the blood bank buddy. Dude, he's healing so fast, actually. What's doing that? What is making us? I'm healing really fast, too. Is that Mothra being in the vicinity? She's perfect for utilizing Crisco for blood. I could do this forever. He just heals up forever. Oh, my God. I might just hang him up from the wall, actually. <laughs> That's I need to talk to somebody about making a mod like that. We can double blood drain him. If I had more reusables in here, we could triple. Wow. I'm... Woof! Almost just used the uh, sucking in the wrong terminology, which would have resulted in horrible, horrible comments. Horrible comments! I mean, 21 should be fine. Like, how much blood do we really need off this? <laughs> I feel like 21 is way too much, but it's... Gotta get what you can get. But he's almost like this. That, that Mothra is, like, the best thing ever for a base. I, I literally do just need a mod developer to make something so we could hang Frisco upside down like a blood bag in Mad Max. That would... <gasps> That would be so cool! Okay, based on how long it's taken to tame this stuff, I'm assuming we only need- Oh, it crafts a bunch. Crafts five at a time, too. So yeah, this should be enough. Let's go ahead and get jumping, jumping meat. Let's go ahead and get a little more, shall we? And then that should be good. I guess bringing Mothra over there is kind of overkill. We could just bring Fiona. I do love bringing Mothra places, though, but I do agree she is tremendous overkill. But she's so amazing! And she heals and dances. Damn it, my standards are so much higher now with creatures than before. When we get to Genesis 2 and not a single one of those creatures has dancing emotes, I just don't even know how I'm gonna emotionally handle it. This is pretty exciting. This is adding up quickly to be one of my favorite methods to tame a creature. Feed it babies? That's awesome, dude. Especially little monsters, bastard babies that have been messing with me the entire time. Wow, I should... Oh my god, I forgot we're supposed to name our, our crab Syntac because we name all of our crab Syntac after that Monster Hunter Survival Series. That just reminded me because whenever I see stuff that color, it reminds me of Syntac. That, that's his color. The man was pretty smart to, to, to monopolize the color. I should have focused one, but I don't even have a favorite color. Orange? No, green. No, see, I don't even, I don't know shit. What the fudge? There he is down by the water. Being awesome. All right, so craft human flesh from the engrams from blood pack and raw meat, then send tamed SCP-939 after it. When it kills, to use the up. Shoot, can babies attack stuff? I, oh, crap, <laughs> hang on. That baby tried to attack me though, like that little hostile turd came right after me. So, I'm sure babies, at least this baby attack stuff. I come stacked with attack babies. All right, little buddy, get him. What are you running for? This is like backfiring in numerous ways. How you can just charge at me, but you're terrified of the Wendigo. I guess that makes sense. He's way scarier. Come on, this is silly. You stupid baby, you prove useless. He's still on us too. 
Are we faster than him? We're faster than him. I can't believe that baby just chickened out, dude. Why did that thing try to attack me, but it doesn't attack other stuff? The audacity. I gotta go get a freaking adult. I guess we can. I'm not even gonna go retrieve that kid. That thing is dead to me already. That that little freeloader's gone. Holy shit, man. You really see Mothra's wings like God, that really puts it in perspective right there. She's so kind of petite now from the front of it, but like her wings go so much farther beyond base than any of these other guys. It's crazy. It's so perfectly done. Her wingspan had to be most of her. That's just what makes her so magnificent. Why did I come back here? Oh yeah, we need an adult. Get out of there, buddy. Okay, good, good, good. Oh crap. Come on, jetpack. Lots in your hands right now. Okay, we got a full-on adult. Fantastic. I'm already bleeding and probably gonna go to sleep very soon now. Thanks a lot, you son of a bitch. I gotta land one of these shots before I freaking fall asleep. And he eats me. Woof! What's going on over here? Oh my god. Everything sucks. Oh, he bit me again. I'm definitely going to sleep now. Definitely going to sleep. For shizzle. Like, it's it's gonna happen. It's an inevitability. Good. He's running away. Come on. Where is he going? Come on, Torpor. It's like one last little droplet to sink in. Oh, you bitch! Alright, let's well, see the freaking side effects of what he does to us. Let's eat up and then we should be fine. Dude, he's booking it across the landscape. Why are you making this so difficult? Oh, I was really hoping that one was going to be one of those crazy shots that just lands out of nowhere, but... Nope! No! Son of a bitch! This is like the worst place to fall asleep! Oh, you bastard. You dirty bastard. Little twerp. Unbelievable. The crap you have put me through, young man. And once again, I forgot to bring button. It's like a consistent theme in these videos. Actually, I really don't care what we feed this thing because it's getting sacrificed to the gods. So, never mind. I don't know why I thought it had to be... Like, I have just scatterbrained today, but... I guess you guys are probably used to that. I, my brain doesn't really wake up to like two or three in the afternoon. And if you wait that long to record videos, then you just simply won't make any videos for the day. So you guys have had this idiot for years now. All right, good. You do that. And then we feed you to the Wendigo. Or Wendigo, if you want to, again, argue with Sam and Dean. But I think that's a sin on its own. I don't know. I can't remember if they covered that. Okay, so I've got my human meat, right? I've got my sacrifice. We should have everything. It's a very small to-do list of two basic items, but I don't know, man. My brain is just dookie. All right, where did he go? Where did my child even go? You don't care, Johnny. You just, you're just saying it because you think you're supposed to. Well, the other creature's got to be right... Okay, so... I mean, it's just, he's in a nice little area, at least. That's cool. Hopefully, he kills my creature, though. Like, imagine the backfire if he freaking kills, if my creature kills him. We're gonna look real stupid. Why is he just attacking me and not the creature? What's going on here, bro? The creature, my SCP is gonna kill it because he's just attacking me. Okay, so. Do I have to be super duper well hidden or something? Do I have to have some sort of invisibility granted? When it kills them, use the opportunity to run up and feed it real quickly. Okay, come on, kill my dude. There we go. Good, 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 good. And then we just watch. Right when our guy dies, we run over there and feed him some snacks. It's gonna take him a fat minute he's not doing damage to our SCP. Oh my god. Do you mind? I'm trying to observe beauty. All right, what is going on up here? I wonder if that bleed effect is just limiting its ability to damage stuff, like it's making it derp or something. I don't know what's going on here. And just go ahead and assist it. There we go, now he's attacking. I think it was the bleed effect. I'm so sorry about this creature. This must be very confusing for you to have something tame you and bring you in off the streets just to shoot you and sacrifice you to a Wendigo, but that's just, that's showbiz, baby. Run, Johnny! I forgot to put it in my last slot. I hate myself. I hate myself so much. I hate everything that is me. Does not want to be fed. Oh, it is. Okay, ready to eat, but it just ate, but it doesn't want. It does not want to be tamed right now, but it's ready to. Who the water? All right. Well, I guess we need to go get a few nine three nines. But luckily, they're all over the place and taming like two darts, so it should be easy. Okay, holy crap, that took forever, but we should finally be good to go. I got eight more of them. This one's the eighth one I can find who is an adolescent, but he's like about to grow up. So it's just he's literally being raised to the slaughter. This should be enough, though. 
Theoretically. Theoretically, it should be. So we're just gonna keep sending them down there one at a time. I'm assuming it's one uh, 939 for every meat that it needs to eat, which is nine, so nine, 939s. Makes sense to me. I just ate one of the freaking meats. Oh my God, that jetpack button. All right, calm down, jetpack. I gotta make sure, like, he doesn't actually just kill the freaking Wendigo. I feel like that could totally happen. 939s are, are vicious. I feel like I'm accidentally shooting the Wendigo. If it, oh my God, it's a close one. Stop it. Stop reciprocating damage. It's gonna fly up in the stratosphere, dude. It's so weak, though. Why does it have to be? I guess you have to just send your creatures at it passive. I didn't realize, man. He's gonna bleed to death just on his own. Should be fine. Should be fine. Put the gun away, Johnny. Don't accidentally shoot him. Doesn't want to be tamed right now. Well, when does he want to be tamed? Is it because he's bleeding? No, he ate. He did eat. Woof! It's so weak though, dude. Should I just like spam fed him right there? Just because it didn't necessarily say feed him, but he still ate? I don't know. He's repairing at a pretty good rate considering he's still bleeding out pretty badly. I mean, I'm assuming he's got to have some pretty dark supernatural powers. Holy crap! Wow, when that blood wore off, he sure started booking it. Okay, good. Get back up. I guess I can keep sending my creatures at it. They don't have to. Like, I can just, I can just make sure they're all passive every time so they don't hurt them back. That's probably what we're gonna have to do. What's going on, BB-8? All right. So everybody, calm down. Aggro him towards the 939. Good, good, good. He attacks it. Good, good, good. Takes a fat minute for him to kill it for some reason. There's some sort of hitbox issue going on here for sure. There we go. Oh, damn it. Oh, God. That's like the last time you want that jetpack to be failing for you. I'm just gonna fly up till you no longer see me. There we go. I'm just dangerously witness like an angel. Watching my own child. Oh, it's already at 1.9. It's it's healing pretty damn fast. Even my bullets aren't registering. I think 939 is just being a little buggy right now. There we go. Easy does it. He's not sitting and chilling out that time. Is it because I killed it? It's because it said fat balls killed it last second. I swear to God if I just ruined it. Just turn you passive. Right, buddy? You're a good boy. Good passive buddy. Go down there. Go do it. Come on. You are failing me right now. There we go. All right, it's good. Sacrifice. No, wait down there in the sacrificial pit. There we go. The creature comes out to feast. Good, good, good. I just have to make sure I don't steal his kill this time. It looks like each meat's doing a fat chunk. I don't necessarily think it's gonna take nine. So hopefully we get to just have that mess up right there. It's a good thing I'm so long to chew on it though. I gotta get down there. Look at our bodies being sacrificed, though. It's a filthy, filthy thing. All right, he's about to die. It's about to be our opportunity. Go ahead and strike him down. One more slash. One more slash right to the gullet. I feel like I can just already feed him. He has zero food. Like, I feel like I don't need to be doing a 939 for every single death. This seems like ridiculous overkill. I didn't realize our tracker was still on. But you gotta do what you gotta do to secure the tame. Buddy, just strike him down. He's such an easy little. He's, he's so weak. Just made sure one little. It's crazy how even my bullets aren't registering for him. I wonder what's going on down there. Yeah, see, it only allows me once per. Tis for the best. Looks like we're past halfway though, and I'm not halfway done with my 939s, so I guess I am pretty halfway done with my 939s. Never mind, crap. One more creature passive, one more creature to the slaughter! Go on, go on to the slaughter. God, you're making me look so uncool! There he goes, to the slaughter. Now feast, feast on him. The strike just ruined everything, I saw it coming. Okay, good, 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 good. Why are you mad at me? I just saved your life, stupid. There, I shall make this easier. God damn it, Johnny, I'm gonna kick you in the nuts. I gotta stop killing my own creatures. Oh my God, getting kicked right in the nuts for that one, you stupid bastard. The second this video ends, I'm getting abused. I'm not safe around me. Oh God. Whoopsie doodles. Oh no, don't tell me he's stuck behind a rock. That would be so incredibly foolish. 
I'm gonna die trying to get him unstuck from that rock. It just sounds like suicide. I wonder if I can just kind of like... Position him right there. Go on, get a little closer. Go on, there's no reason to unstick him. It might. Why am I still clicking that? My freaking jetpack button. That's why I keep falling. Come on, get a little closer. Just close enough for him to smack you. I don't think he can even attack in his position. Oh, I could not have served him up for you better than that, bro. That's just on you. On the upside, our other one's an adult now, so that's pretty cool. I almost forgot about this guy. Okay, we should have enough with just these three. Ideally, I am the one down there on the floor. Absolutely. I just can't shoot any more of them. This is intense, Nicole's right here. Make sure the jetpack's on. I'm flying away the second this rock's destroyed. I'd be so mad if I accidentally hit him. Like, if he just... Whoop! Oh, Jetpack, you are failing me, bud, with some of the zero altitude type crap right now. Are you kidding me? Is it the pickaxe? What's doing it? What's... That's like we have no altitude right now. Not really sure. Some serious malfunctions right now. Oh my god, that is some dangerously serious malfunctions. Can I seriously not go up? I can't go up! There's a conflict of interest. The man's got to go up on his jetpack. Like, this is... Oh my god. Shit just got real. All right, I'm just gonna stand back and let this thing play out naturally, and I guess just like run away. Like we're, we're officially done with jetpacks. This survival series, <laughs> my jetpack has just failed me, dude. I guess we still have a bit of a glide going. We have a bit of a super jump. Not even, dude. Barely, barely even a super jump. We've been neutered completely. Okay, good. He's attacking our creature again. Thank the Lord. This is getting more and more complicated. It's not even this creature's fault. Like, how does this, what is this? It's so insulting. There's no way I have to go run back to base and make another one either. I think I just have to relog or something, but I don't trust relogging necessarily just yet. There's way too much on the line. Although I definitely just should because this was my whole game plan. I don't even have a grapple cut on me. Right? Actually, hang on. This thing does bug out a buttload, but I'd rather not die is the thing. Okay, never mind. We have a plan B. Thank God for our grapple wrist attachments. <laughs> I love all these gadgets in the Star Wars mod. Yes! It ate him. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Good. Eat the snack. Good. I wonder if three more is going to be enough for that guy, dude. I don't know if it is. I don't necessarily know if it is. I think I'm going to have to go get another. This guy is giving me heartburn. Okay, there we go. That one I actually sent down as a one-shot, which is what I should have been doing this entire time, obviously. This whole thing has been just riddled with disaster, but in the end, I don't care. <laughs> yes! So much more efficient this way. Excuse me. Dangling down. Taking me forever. Some forever dangles right there. Pull me back up quickly, for love of God. Still in his little peaceful mode. I love it. Okay, hopefully one more does the trick, dude. I'm really hoping. Really hoping against hope on this one. Yeah, he wants my nuts. He can't get these nuts. These nuts aren't on the dinner course. Yeah, we have two left. There's no friggin' way it's not gonna be enough. No way, Jose. Go ahead and you down a bunch. A little bit more. Don't tell me you're stuck in a rock, buddy. That's the dumbest crap that could possibly happen to somebody. One more. And here he comes, right on cue. The beast to the slaughter. So perfectly. Don't tell me there's another rock in your guys' way. Come on! <whistles> Quit letting rocks get in your way of love. I fell down. I fell down and I hate myself. You calm down. You're meant to die. Just stand there and die. Okay, good, good. Everyone, everyone just get your shit together. We're all on the same page. We're all on the same page. Parachute down, eat your snacks. Go. <gasps> no way, dude. I got him. Holy crap, I really didn't think it was going to happen. Like, I had my doubts. That was one of the most complicated things that I've kept messing up consistently in forever. Look at those poops. Healthy poops. That's my poops. That's his. Okay, I get it. It's just falling out of there. The forever poops. And here's our beast. It's got its bloodthirsty adrenaline. Your SCP-323 wants more food. Triple or damage tripled and damage resistance increased by 75%, but hunger increases rapidly. So I guess we just gotta keep the beast well fed then. Sounds good to me, man. 
So that's what that bloodthirsty adrenaline is. Imagine this thing once it's powered up and fully leveled. Jesus Christ. I love it. I love it so much. This thing looks absolutely terrifying. I am concerned about the poops. A healthy pooper is a healthy creature. Dude, bloodthirsty adrenaline lasts for so damn long. Oh my god, it's like the best creature ever. Oh, I get slashed, homie! What a death animation. That guy really leaned into it. How overdramatic. Let's go ahead and try that out on this guy! Why is this, this thing almost does as much damage as my Mothra. Once it's max level, this is gonna be such a violent beast. But it is meant to be. It's the freaking Wendigo. If it was a weenie, it would suck. I'll bet those those bones impaling my butt are going to leave so much damage for years to come. Just have so much long. There's so long left. It's so nice to have an SCP or stuff in here that doesn't just get schmeckledorfed. I mean, I know I'm just necessarily hunting vanilla creatures, but SCP stuff is meant to blend in with vanilla. Like, it's all supposed to be generally statted the same so nothing destabilizes the world. This thing may appear to be overpowered, but that's just because it was a huge pain in the ass to tame. It is more of like a super duper creature. I love it so much. It needs a name. But what do we name it? What are, whoa, shit! What's happening? Hang on. Okay. In all my years of arc, this has never happened to me. I don't know. Is this all my broken jetpacks kicking in at once? I'm so confused. It's like... This is so trippy. Oh, that's what it is. I'm being infinitely pulled back on a zip line. There's no way that's what just happened. That doesn't even make any damn sense. Like, I don't know about that. I feel like my transportation mods are definitely messing with me a little bit, but it's all in fun and games. I'm, it's, that, that was a hell of an experience. All right, so I hate to end this video right here, right when we get a new creature, but I'm hypoglycemic, and I just spent about an hour taming stuff to get this guy, so I'm pretty hungry right now. I'm starting to get pretty faint, but both of these creatures in front of my face do both need name suggestions. Like, that is a thing. That is a fact of nature, so make sure to drop them down below. If it's pretty enough or awesome, of course it'll get picked. Leave a like on the video, subscribe, and I'll see you beautiful people in the next episode. Peace!